Reno's bio is in all caps, but I'm not going to shout it. <laughs> Although Reno has made several films and TV shows for HBO, Bravo, and others, live performance, preferably in front of smart folks, is her preferred, preferred medium. She will be at Dixon Place starting in February. Here is Reno! something that uh, occurs to me. You know, the human race, as it's called, uh, it's really more like that human standstill, but nevertheless, uh, well, you know, we, I suppose I'm one of them, uh, have accomplished many great things, let's face it, many amazing things that most people, or very often people say, uh, they put a man on the moon, you know, that's like the offset human accomplishment. I don't say that because I'm thinking, put a man on the moon. Yeah, then what? I, you know, have you heard of the moon since that day? I mean, <laughs> what the fuck? I don't care, really. I mean, I'm back to the green cheese thing, you know, and, um, but we have, you know, we've done a lot. Lasagna, for example, very good uh, human achievement. Uh, same March Poetry Project is another. Panda, Panda. And, um, oh, plug-in vibrator. I mean, you can't get along without uh, the plug-in. The battery's just, uh, I don't know. I, maybe I'm uh, resistant. Uh, it's just, just not enough. Uh, yeah, you know, people, people have accomplished amazing things. Uh, it's just that uh, governing doesn't seem to be one of them. Governing, we, we leaders have never made the right decisions, rarely. They make the wrong, at the very exact wrong moment, they make the wrong fucking decisions. Take a, all right, I wasn't there or anything, but Troy, for example. I mean, this might be the ultimate uh, Monday morning quarterbacking, but, uh, <laughs> Horse. What a sweet, pretty horse. Come on in. They're in the middle of a fucking war. There's a pretty horse, 7,000 times bigger than any other fucking horse anybody saw. Come on in. I mean, don't you think the leaders should have, like, sent somebody out to scout somebody? I don't know, a veterinarian, somebody. But no. And this is why I think...
foaming. I don't know. <laughs> Absolutely no reason for that today. Let's have a big, huge battle for, the, for these people who are saving us from government tyranny by having their guns. Put them all in there on one side. We put the United States' best possible military the world has ever seen on the other side. I think this would be a brilliant use of the United States military. <laughs> How long would that battle be? About, I don't know, 20 seconds. And then, instead of like a buyback program, which a lot of uh, municipalities uh, have tried to uh, buy back guns from the people, instead of that we have this, we can just, after it's over, 20 seconds later, we can just, as the NRA says, pick up all those guns and pry them out of their cold, dead hands. Oh. Woo. That's what I'm going to do with my new year. I'm going to plan that party. <laughs> Good night. Woo. Thank you.